boating as a fisherman? Wally here from the boating scene once again. This week I thought we'd cover manual battery switches. As you can see here, there's quite an array of uh, manual switches available in the market, but the basic two that are, that are used is a dual battery switch like this one, and also your, your single battery switch, an on-off switch. The key switch itself does exactly what I just said. It's, it makes contact with the battery, and then by flicking the switch, disconnects the battery voltage. The dual battery setup, that allows you to run one battery and another battery. It allows you to isolate the battery, either run it on one, run it with both batteries, ba both batteries for, a, for a bit of a jump start, or run on the other battery. Where a lot of people get in trouble with this particular one is, they tend to do this. They, they go to all the trouble of installing a dual battery setup and run it on both, which effectively makes it one heavy duty battery. Only problem with running it on both all the time, if you get a crook cell in one battery, it will draw the current out of the good battery very quickly and you'll have no benefit from this. What we recommend to all the people that uh, we hook these up to is to run it on one. Next fishing trip, run it on the other. Try and, you know, try and, try and basically, you know, not run on, on both at any one particular time. And that will make sure you get benefit. Because if you get a flat battery, you've fallen asleep or something's gone wrong on the boat, you can switch over to number two, start the engine and come home. Thanks very much, guys. Bye.